and as part of an initiative aimed at providing free comprehensive health care services to residents. The Lagos State Government has launched the Alafia Eco Medical Outreach across its six health districts. Speaking at the launch of the program on Thursday in Lagos, Special Advisor to Lagos State Governor on Health, Kemi Oguyemi, disclosed that the whole essence is to ensure that all citizens in Lagos have access to affordable and quality health care. The Alafia Eco Medical Outreach is officially commencing, making the beginning of the initiative. This outreach is a crucial component of the comprehensive Eco Cares program, which aims to alleviate the challenges faced by Lagosians in assessing health care services amidst the current economic difficulty. With regards to Alafia Eco, where the Ministry of Health was actually involved, what we did was we decided that we will have four units per district, making 24 units, and we will see 1,000 um, citizens per unit, which equals to 4,000 per district, times six is 24,000. And I'm sure we're gonna see more than that. Um, absolutely, as you can see, there are quite a few people, you know, this is just one of the units, and it's all across Lagos. It's the first ever, nobody, no other state in Nigeria has ever done such, where the state is actually giving free um, health care to all its citizens, as many that are sick as possible. The special advisor also disclosed that the residents who besieged the centers will assess the services and medications free of charge. All pregnant women still get antenatal care free, delivery is free, whether it's caesarean section or normal delivery is still free, and that has been on for some months. All pregnant women do not pay for antenatal care services. It's, there's an opportunity to register for LASHMA, uh, Ilera Eko, and then they will be given a hundred people in each of the uh, centers that we're using. We're using 24 centers, 24 points for this outreach. A hundred people will be getting free access to health insurance for one year. And those people are the people that we consider vulnerable. So there's a way they determine here, there's a questionnaire they will use to get to find out if you're a vulnerable person, someone who can't afford treatment, who can't afford access by themselves, and they will get uh, access to free treatment for a year. Beneficiaries were provided with complementary checkups and treatments at various locations, such as Campus Memorial Mini Stadium in Igbushiri and Bariga Local Council Development Area. These services encompassed blood sugar and blood pressure assessments, HIV counseling and testing, eye examination, and the provision of free glasses. We really appreciate and we really appreciate and we want to give kudos to our governor, our performing governor, for doing fit and believe in X, that X is wet. And at the same time, the assurance we are giving you is not about assurance. It's simple. You can see the number of turnout. The program, the program now that we are expecting 500 today for the first day. By now, the accreditation has reached over 400. This is all from Mr. Selebu himself, Mr. Governor, Mr. Baba Jide Songolu, who has been very magnanimous and compassionate to provide for us free health services across the state. Particularly, we have free blood pressure checks, free blood sugar checks. We have free HIV counseling and testing, free eye checks, free eye glasses for those that need, free consultations and drugs. In fact, for those who have, uh, who require up, up, upgrade drugs, in another two weeks they can come to our facilities to get those drugs free. The objective is to have 1,000 individuals attending each event in six health districts resulting in a minimum of 25,000 residents of Lagos benefiting from the initial phase of the program. Love Uyedoku, Plus TV News.